Hey guys and girls, how you doing? Ferro TV here. It is time to open some packs and discuss this week's uh, blah, blah, blah. this week's pigs. Um, we did not get such an outstanding score this time, which is kind of sad because I really expected us to kick ass with this deck. But well, still third place, still fine. Beat our little sister team, Merc Heroes, and I mean that's good. That's good enough. I mean, it was far away from the second place, so nobody has to feel bad that it's because of him. <laughs> it was a team effort and it didn't work out. So it's, I feel like it's been some time when I got a legendary in here. I mean, I just got my card meant to level. Rare, rare, rare. Okay, rare it's no, good. it's nothing. <laughs> I, I don't mind the cannibal Timmy's though, to be honest. It's not, I snap by Wendy's are always like a slap in the face. Don't mind Terence and Philip at all. We're getting close, so I can use them in TVT at some point. But the rest. Epic. That not must feel too. Good. Who oh, yeah. Ah, yeah. uh, it smelt. It just smelt. Oh, and one minute we can request. <laughs> By the way, I'm gonna be streaming the Mintberry Crunch to, uh, event today all night, probably. Like, I don't have to get up too early tomorrow, so I'm gonna. Gonna get some caffeine going and then get streaming. Now I already like gave some thought into it and I would prefer to play Gnomes plus Pal and Butters and not play the double Butters because I think most people will still have him on level 3. Well, a good chunk of people will have him on level 3 and maybe not even maxed out. I mean the, the materials are scarce on the superhero theme and you used up most of the initial burst of materials on cards that were there from the beginning which wasn't the case for Butters, so that's just my two cents about the superhero theme cards. Now, it's interesting, Cartman is pretty cool, I guess, but there's Transmogrify and there's also the possibility of Cock Magic, and Cock Magic could, could be interesting in this one. Um, the benefit of Cock Magic is stuff like Mosquito already spawns two things, you own, like, imagine like just a combo of Cartman and Cock Magic could be interesting uh, Cartman and Mosquito could be interesting um, also obviously to transmogrify uh, to uh, cock magic the grand wizard and there is backline units which you cannot reach otherwise um, so yeah it's debatable I guess like the amazingly Randy like the backline protecting the backline can be a huge deal in this one and that's why yeah it's debatable now that's an interesting choice here. I think actually this might be better because he's just such a beast. Taking out units out of action for such a long time is really, really beneficial. When it comes to the Kenny though, I must say definitely this one. It saves you caps. It saves you a lot of caps and it saves you from using a level two Mysterion for a lot of people. And a level two Mysterion just is shit. Now, if like, it. We, I know we have a few superhero whales in our team. Um, if it turns out then like more, and more than 50% actually have Mysterion on level 3, I'm willing to change my vote, but honestly I doubt it and I feel like this might have snowballed a little fast and at the end of the day we might pick Kenny because there's not much cap saving going on. As far as I see it, it's pretty much only Transmogrify where we save caps. And maybe we could decide to just not level the chomper and have it as a dead card. That's a possibility, but other than that, I don't really see the cap saving. Now, I agree actually with the vote of double stan. We have double stan right here. Tool shed and this stan. I don't think she's the best option since we will all have her not even on level three probably. So he will some of us will have him on four. The the tiny superhero weights will have him on five. And some will have it on three, which is still better than her on such a high energy cost card on um, two or three. But I think that's it for this week's picks. Amazingly Randy was obvious I did this while talking about something else, but sorry, I, I like talked away from the microphone the whole time because I had my blue sticks on my left screen. Sorry for that. I guess you still could hear me. Hear me. <clears throat> and that's for the picks. Let's go for the PC baby after I oh damn it I cannot ask I oh, never mind the PC baby asked for Timmy I was confused uh, 
Sadly, my swordsman isn't level 6 yet because I'm gonna be playing Buccaneer Baby all night, it seems. Um, I will pl maybe play Adventure on all three accounts to grind out the event. Um, so we'll see Buck, Buck Baby action like more than in the entire last two years on my channel, I believe. Like it's gonna be Buck Baby all over the place. Too bad, too bad he isn't level 4 yet. But he, Buck Baby will be level 4 on the PC Murphy and I'm not sure maybe it's gonna be level 4 on the PC baby as well which is good enough but I think using fireball in this event is beneficial for all the mint berries that might be roaming around or uh, not not even like the mint berries but the kites I think like people will play the superhero with the superhero points and kite is like always like easy to put him into the deck. If you play superheroes, you're probably gonna play Kite. That's what I think. Sadly, my sadly my Adventure Locked account did not get Garrison. This, this event was too much of a pain. I got 400 tokens on both of my other accounts, like the PC Baby and the PC Murphy, but um, to guarantee... Like, the PC Baby actually got lucky. The second to last team pack got him the garrison card but my pc murphy did not get anything regarding that i just opened them on my way home in the train it's a little bit annoying that i have to join this event so late it's already 8 pm that means i'll have to do upload this and it's probably gonna be close to nine when i stream ah, beautiful beautiful fight really close matches here I um, actually like played the PC Baby and I got zero points, by the way. I haven't uploaded the PC Baby because I was actually drawing the first two games against legendary players, like 6,300, and I got fed up and, okay, I feel like this is gonna take ages. I'm not recording this, I'm not uploading this, this takes way too long to upload. <laughs> if this is gonna be 35 minutes or whatever, and it's boring as fuck. And after that, though, I lost three matches against similar strong opponents, so... To not leave you guys completely out of the loop with the PC Baby TVT, that's what happened. It was just me playing playing level 3 legendaries and level 4 epics and defending with all I have. Knowing I cannot win and just defend. It worked two times for a draw and the next three times I got stomped. More rare than a common, right? Oh, this looks good. Whoa, nice rare. I don't care about the Nathans. No! Okay. <laughs> okay, I'll take the new card as well. Sadly for the PC baby this time, no, no action. No action right there. I'm not gonna vote it here. I will do that later. No need to waste your guys' time in the video. Now people who jump forward can just easily have a shorter time to skip, I guess. Ah, uh, yeah, but I'm looking forward to the stream. Even though I'm a little bit tired, I'll I'll keep hanging in there. I mean, if Haze can do 24 hours, I can do a long stream on at the end of my day <laughs> when I'm already a little bit tired. Should be doable. Playing some Buck, playing some Mintberry Crunch, and has, at all playing some superheroes again will be fun. I hope that not to that not everyone has finished it yet, and I'm still meeting people on Ferro TV that have suboptimal decks as well. Would be too bad if that wouldn't be the case. Ah. All right, German wine park time. I think I ha I think I got one legendary so far on TVTC. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I got one of the two member picks in TBT. First place! And with quite the difference. Haha. Uh -huh. Sweet, sweet. We're gonna be Bronx soon, I feel like. Holding my breath. Okay, the comments so far suck. Oh, we don't get one. <laughs> Oh, the rares suck as well. Huh, a rare. Can it be? Oh my god. Epic? How help. about getting President Garrison now? <laughs> Shelly's, by the way, a really nice thing to get. And... Epic. 
Like Big Mesquite Murph is able to get to level 3. That's interesting. I could make that happen. Cool. I might do that. I might do that though I'm lagging the materials. Well, I got, I see you guys on the stream. Maybe I'm already live. Probably not. Probably I'll, it'll take a little bit more. I'm actually deciding to just donate a uh, request super part now because I can't get that on my own. And I make it level 5. But I also donate it back. <laughs> And we'll level up. All right, with that, I'll end the video. We'll see each other on the stream. And hope we have a nice night with some lucky drops and some easy wins. Goodbye.